In the 1950s, we had big computers that filled entire rooms. In the 2020s, we have big computers that fill entire rooms that also become buzzwords online. My name is Alex Solani. I'm a second year PhD student at the University of Plymouth, and my research is on quantum computer music. Three words we've all heard of before, but not many have been crazy enough to combine in that specific order. Many of us are familiar with music and audio, like MP3 files, but what is a quantum computer? As far as a layperson is concerned, a quantum computer is just a different flavor of computer that could possibly be useful. A type that follows rules, just not the same set of rules as before. Okay, so we have computers made from atoms now. Cool. So what can they be used for? Some think applications are in biology and chemistry, but at the University of Plymouth we said, well, what about audio? When someone asks me, Alex, what is quantum computer music? I say, well, basically we are trying to create new tools for music producers, not replace them. Imagine GarageBand, but with fresh tools. And if they remain curious, they say, okay, sit, new tools for music producers, but what do you do specifically? In my case, I am distorting audio, but on quantum computers. Like, you know how guitars have those distortion pedals rock bands use? Well, I take digital audio and manipulate it on a quantum computer to try to get cool sounds like those distortion effects. So, to recap, take the digital audio we all know and love, like an MP3 file, encode the digital audio on a quantum computer, perform some operations, which is how I get distortion, then bring it back to the classical world to hear the results. And well, in my research, it turns out that when I use certain gates, gates being ways to operate on the digital audio when it's on a quantum computer, I can get this sort of 8-bit video game Atari sound, which leads me to my demo for this 3-minute Stevie Wonder competition, which shows that in my research, we can take a sound that sounds like this, something that sounds like this. <laughs> 